build some big biceps over here. Everyone knows the way to build big arms is to heave as much weight as you possibly can. Hey guys, Coach Royce here to go over the basics. Barbell bicep curls. So I did another video on how to build bicep peaks and this is closely related because you don't actually have to perform bicep peak building movements to develop your bicep peaks. What you actually want to focus on is stressing your biceps to their peak potential, building them to their peak potential. And a basic barbell curl, you can develop the peak of your bicep doing a basic barbell curl if you do it properly. Most commonly what you see in the bicep curl, first of all, people don't even initiate the movement from their biceps. They initiate it with an anterior roll of the shoulder. Shoulder rolls forward, elbow starts at a bend, and then they hinge forward at the shoulder first and then perform only about this much range of motion for the bicep. What you want to do when you start your bicep curl is roll your shoulders back, lock them into position, and literally hinge at the elbow only. Boom. Just like that. You don't want your elbows going forward. That's kind of a controversial topic because people argue that you can still develop your biceps by doing this, and yes you can, but for the sake of the basics and developing the biceps peaks and the biceps to their um, maximum potential via maximum stress. This is my argument. Lock the shoulders back into external rotation. Lock them in place. Elbows don't move. Literally hinge at the elbow joint all the way as high as you can curl to get a maximum biceps contraction. Look at this range of motion in my elbow here. Maximum range of motion and maximum biceps stress. That's the way you make your biceps respond, with stress, not with heavy poundage, and not necessarily with different types of movements, even though this can actually work. So, guys, shoulders back, lock in position, strict form, and none of this. No hinging at the shoulders, alright? That's all for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed my video on biceps. We'll see you next time.